Hi, I'm Richard Byrne. In this video, I'm going to give you a short overview of the AI in Adobe Express that you can use to generate images. Let's go ahead and take a look at how it works. I'm signed into my Adobe Express account and I'm going to click on Generative AI. And you can see here we have text to image. We also have text effects, which are pretty cool as well. But let's use the text to image for now. And let's say I need an image of a puppy, puppy playing in a field with sheep. Let's see what we get. And so this is what we get. And you can see over here, I have some options for other images that it generates. That one's kind of weird. I can't really tell what the puppy is or what the sheep is in that one. So let's go to this one. Ah, oh, that's a better one with a puppy and the sheep in the background. Or this one here with the puppy and the sheep in the background. And you can see I can load even more down below there. But we also have the options here for content type. If I wanted to switch it up and instead of just letting Adobe choose for me, I could choose and say I want a photograph, I want a graphic, or I want an artistic rendering. And you can see there I can also style it a little bit if I like. Let's say I want to make that like a little palette knife and see what happens there when I apply it that way and see how that changes the image. Oh, there we go. And now we have some puppies with sheep in the background. And when I find one that I like, let's go ahead and download that image. And you can see, you can download it as a PNG, JPEG, or a PDF file. So that's how you can use Adobe Express's new AI for generating images to use in your projects. As always, for more things like this, including a lot more Adobe Express tutorials and more AI tutorials, please subscribe to my YouTube channel.